Hello everybody, this is Tara Woodruff from CoachTara.com and it's Sunday and I'm still a little tired, still want to just stay in bed, but I got up, I took a shower and I'm getting ready for my day. I have a really important uh, appointment today, so I'm excited. Anyway, the purpose of today's video is I want to talk to you about this one very important aspect of your business that you're going to need to embrace because uh, there's a couple of reasons why this comes up. Number one, uh, the, the thing that sticks in my head the most right at this moment is this morning I'm reading my Dynamic Laws of Prosperity and we talk about, and the, the part I'm on is the Law of Confidence and she points out that there are people out there that have all these skills but they don't advance in their life and their success and their jobs and their, and their financial situations and their relationships the way that you would think they would because of the skills they have because they lack the confidence and somebody with less skill will be able to go further faster because they've always been very confident in the outcome of their actions okay and then there's another thing I was watching a video yesterday from my friend Viley Dublin he's at a mastermind over in Miami and he had a really powerful inspirational moment he made a video and it was really just wow you know and he was talking about getting into the state he was talking about you need to be in the state. You need to know that no matter what's happening, that you are going to move through it, that you are going to be able to move through it. Now, if you don't think that you can move through it, you won't be able to move through it, right? But on the other side of your fear, on the other side of whatever it is that you think is holding you back is where your success is. It's where the checks get written. It's where it's where the, the cars get bought and the relationships get built and the houses get lived in and that's where the things happen is on the other side of what you think you can't do now does that mean that you have to be um, super talented no it means that you need to have confidence another thing that uh, that came up as a teammate of mine uh, Susan Snowsell she made a video very similar to kinda like the one I'm talking about right now and she was talking about uh, posture now you might hear posture a lot in network marketing you might hear that a lot and it's a good word and it's a very important posture is super important okay super important but true posture can't come out of you unless you have confidence now what is confidence truly what does that really mean what that really means is your faith okay now I've over the years and the videos I've done I've talked about faith and fear you know they can't exist at the same time and you're and if you're trying to be fearful in your success, then your success will wait until you have faith and all these crazy things. And it's 100% absolutely true, guys. If you are struggling to make your network marketing business happen, hello, Morning Cardinal. She agrees. She comes and she says hi. Hello. You hear them? That's them. They're in the bush right here. Anyway, don't mean to distract you, but that was a good distraction because Cardinal's they are like the symbol for confidence. Did you not know that? They're like the totem animal. Maybe they're excited that I'm talking about it because you know what? I want you to succeed. It's my mission in life to help people get through, break through. And the best way for me to do that is to show you by example. Okay? So from here on in, I want you to promise yourself, if you are ser if you're serious, if you're not really serious, about developing that six-figure income this year, about hitting those ranks in your company that you want to hit, if you're really not serious about attending masterminds, if you're not really that serious about getting to your company events, if you're not really that serious about getting your bills paid or making things happen or quitting that job, if you're really not serious about those things, you don't need to listen. But if you are really serious about those things, you need to start developing your confidence and you need to start doing it now and you need to do it no matter what and even if it means that you stand there like Tony Robbins and pound your chest and you I am the best I am the greatest whatever it is you have to do you have to study confidence you have to read about confidence you have to learn about confidence you have to become confident you have to become confident this way all those skills that you've developed all those things and all that patience that you've made and all that the abilities that you've created throughout the times that you've been struggling will people will start to see them because you'll be confident enough to start making results happen inside of your business okay you need to have results happening inside of your business so really beautiful thing about it is over the past what is it 15 days or so I have been developing my confidence with the simplest little thing I didn't even at first I was like how could that even work for me whatever 
I'll give it a try, right? And it's just the simplest 21 day Facebook challenge. I am now in the inbox of people. That was my biggest block, prospecting. I just, I'd rather people come to me. Well, wouldn't you? Well, what I notice is when I lift my confidence up and I follow a simple system, people are messaging me. I wake up and I log into Facebook and I've got 10, 15 messages and they're not from people asking me to marry them so they could move to America. These are from other network marketers looking for help. Okay, so if that's the kind of messaging you're looking forward to, I mean, I know there's a lot of people out there, they'll take screenshots of their messages and there'll be hundreds of them they haven't answered. And not one of them has to do with business because if it did, they'd open that fucking shit and they'd get to work. So, if you are ready to really make it go of it this year, it's 2016, We're to, today's the last day of January. How far have you come this month in your goals that you set for yourself at the beginning of the year? And was it your confidence that kept you from getting all the way? Did you, did you start um, exercising at the gym, but when you got there, you saw all these hard bodies and you started comparing yourself and your confidence went shit, and you stopped going because you can't exercise around all those beautiful people? Did, I mean, th these are all sorts of things that all of us experience, all of us we understand. But if you really want to break through in your life, you want to break through in your health, in your business, you're going to have to nurture confidence. So the thing I'm talking about with you today is I've been nurturing my confidence with a 21 day Facebook challenge and it's been totally crazy, totally, totally crazy. Um, I've increased my monthly income residually by $175 so far. It's not the end of the month either. Um, and that's not it. I mean, I've got all sorts of really great things that have happened this, this past week, this month, and I'm really excited. My, my list is growing and I'm moving forward in confidence, in faith, in my business. And I know February is going to blow this month out of the water. I know that March is going to make January look like, Puh, you thought you were confident. The only way that you can build your confidence is to keep building your confidence so that you can get results, so that you can be more confident, more confident, and more confident, and have that posture you need to have when connecting with a prospect. So if you're ready, CoachTara.com forward slash 21 days. Let's go. Let's go. It's time of wasting. Bye.